Today, we're gonna be attempting to beat the final boss of Duck Life Space. So let's see how easy it is to beat the game with our hacked hypersonic ducks. Also, less than 20% of you guys are actually subscribed. So if you enjoy the video, consider subscribing. So we have all of our ducks here and just look at the stats on these ducks. There is absolutely no way we're gonna lose. I think we found the perfect new addition for our team. This duck was literally abandoned, so we're gonna adopt it. Well, I just randomized the name and it came up with Napoleon. So you know what? I'm gonna stick with this name. Well, Napoleon has joined our team i think it is time to train him up so for some reason even on this frozen planet we can actually train our ducks so we're gonna do exactly that and as you can see we can train six different things for our duck so in this game there is literally a roof that is gonna crush us if we're not fast enough oh no please don't get crushed so this is for our running training this actually seems kind of easy but let's hope we don't get our new duck crushed the mini- Oh no, we're definitely gonna die. Yep, we're gonna die. And as you can see, our scores are crazy. Our running is already level 576. So let's go and train the other things. So in this training, there are space sharks that are trying to eat you. Definitely the training on this planet is more deadly than the other ones because this one literally has a roof that's gonna crush you and sharks that want to eat you. It's so sad. We literally just rescued this guy from being frozen and now he's gonna be crushed and he's gonna be eaten by a shark. Well, you know anything to make money racing our duck? I I don't like this at all. I don't like this. Okay, we are still somehow alive, but very, very soon we're gonna die. There is no way we are staying. Okay, well, we died and we got these hacked scores, but of course we did train the swimming. So this training for fly is absolutely awesome because we're no longer training the duck to fly with its wings. We literally have a spaceship <laughs> and we're shooting bullets to blow up these comets. It's absolutely amazing. So we can blow up all of the comets like these ones, but oh, well, no, apparently we weren't in time there, but we did manage to get some good experience. So so for the climbing training, for some reason, there is a rope hanging in the middle of nowhere with meteors trying to kill you. And also coins. It shoots coins at you as well, which is pretty nice. But other than that, let's try not to get hit off this too soon. I don't know why my duck decided to climb up this rope during a meteor storm, but apparently he thought it was a good idea. I don't know how we're still alive. It is spawning an absolute ton of these meteors. I I'm just gonna stay here. I'm just gonna- Oh no, they're spawning here as well. The mini games in Duck Life Space are definitely a lot better than the other games. Oh, how did I not die that? Well, we just died. Let's go on to the next trainings. Now, this is probably my least favorite training in the entire game. Basically, we just have to control a duck and not get crushed by the ice box. But the problem is they have physics. And as you can see, they will fall on top of you. It is really obnoxious. It's going to be over really soon. There is no way we are surviving in this for much longer. Somehow we are still alive, but the end is very near. There is no way we're going to sub- Yeah, we just, <laughs> we just got absolutely crushed by an ice block. So the final training is intelligence. And we just have to click on the side with the most ducks. And there are also aliens ducks that will try and put you off so i'm gonna try my best it does get pretty difficult though but this training isn't that exciting but honestly i enjoy the challenge Oh, well, we, oh my god, we guessed wrong already. So as you can see, after that training, Napoleon is absolutely insane. Let's challenge all of the ducks on this planet and get to the tournament and get off this planet. Well, we have found our first opponent. And honestly, he does not really look like a duck, but it's all good. Well, of course, we're going to choose Napoleon and we're going to absolutely destroy our enemy right here. So the thing I like about intelligence is that we go through those portals instantly. Just look at that. Wait, what? Wait, did we just... Wait, what just happened? No, no. Oh my god, we just went under the map. Guys, this is kind of a problem. I might have to use another duck. No, we ran out of energy. Let's try this race again, but let's try it with a duck that does not have at level 500 jumping. So I'm hoping this time the game won't break and obviously our intelligence is pretty low, but I'm hoping that our duck is good enough at running and everything else to be able to win this race. Yeah, it looks like we have this one in the bag. We're so good at all of the other stats. I think we're going to disqualify the duck, which is great. Well, this duck says only the strongest will survive. So I think we're going to go for Napoleon, please. <laughs> Napoleon, don't break my game. Don't make me regret using you. Guys, Napoleon broke my game again. Napoleon bro broke my game again. We just got stuck in the wall. This is terrible. Guys, I don't know if we can use Napoleon anymore. So I decided to use regular duck instead. I'm hoping that regular duck won't break the game. And it looks like I think we're good. I think we won't break the game with regular duck. This is amazing. Finally, we're actually going to be able to finish this race. There we go. We got the win. Well, we have our final opponent. We just need to win this race and then then we'll have a ticket to get out of this planet. Napoleon, I'm going to use you one more time. And if you break it, I am never using you.
racing you again, I swear. I adopted you to be good at racing, not to break my game and my laptop. But it looks like this race, yeah, this race is absolutely fine. And it looks like we have disqualified our third opponent and we are allowed to go to the tournament. Well, for this tournament, I'm just going to use these three ducks and hope that they do not break the game because we really need to win this tournament. Well, I'm just going to randomize this a couple of times and see what we get. The black flies. Let's go with the black flies. I mean, none of my ducks are actually black, but it doesn't even matter. Let's go. I forgot how bad we are at climbing. This is terrible. Oh, no. We're amazing at everything else, though, right? Actually, no, we're not. We actually might lose this one. Oh, and we broke the game again. We literally just got... Actually, what happened there? We literally went down to the bottom, and then we somehow teleported, even though we weren't at a teleport. Well, oh, I managed to get first place in the last race, so let's hope that we can get first place again, and then I should have this tournament in the bag if Napoleon does not mess things up. Well, we won our second race, so let's go on to the third race, and let's see if we can finally get off this planet. Well, we got the win with Napoleon as well. He did not crash the game, so it looks like we're gonna get off this planet. Well, Black Flyers came first, so let's go, and I believe yep there's more backstory so it looks like the alien that stole our crown actually wants to race me now so let's choose the original dog and let's see how easy this alien is to beat with our hacks and of course this guy actually said i was cheating before and he was right because technically i am cheating but what is he gonna do about it we're gonna absolutely destroy this alien now this isn't the boss fight we are gonna face him again what well, i believe we just disqualified him from his oh no he's actually gonna finish he's actually pretty fast you know what well, we won we also stole his money so let's see what he has to say now you may have beat me in a race but i am keeping the crown dude this guy is dirty well i mean to be fair so am i because i'm literally cheating so it looks like he's taking our crown into his spaceship we're gonna try and fly after him with our crazy flying skills we're gonna actually go on his spaceship and we're gonna go onto the final planet and as you can see it looks pretty insane so it looks like we have three different ducks that we have to beat, and we also have a spaceship in the background and as you can see there is nowhere we can train here we just have to fight him with what we have have. I just made Napoleon into a fire dog. So let's see if we can win all of these matches. Well, our first opponent is pretty rude. He's saying he's going to enjoy me falling into a volcano and dying. Well, he wasn't wrong about the volcano. I'm pretty sure there are going to be fields of lava. So hopefully we don't die there. Actually, that looks really cool. There's a lava fall right there, but it doesn't even matter. We're going to jump instantly and we're going to finish this race. Well, we won the race and we got a key. Okay, so I guess we have to get three keys. Yeah, we need two more keys until we can unlock the spaceship. Swimming is really refreshing in this heat. Have a race with it, guys. This is not a duck anymore. This is literally Satan. Well, we've chosen Napoleon again, and he is going to absolutely destroy this Satan. Oh my god, what just happened? Oh, we are going so high in the air. Please do not fall in any lava. Okay, I think we're good. Oh, did we actually touch the flag there, or did we go? No, I think we won that race, but that was close. Well, we got the second key. We only have to get one more key, and I believe it is from this guy. Oh no. Oh, no. I think it happened again, guys. No! We just went under the map. Okay, we need to go back. We need to quit now. Well, I chose duck. Hopefully duck won't. Oh my god, we're flying upwards. Is that even a thing? In all of the other duck games, I'm pretty sure you can only fly downwards. So that's actually kind of cool, but it looks like duck is not going to destroy the laptop. And oh no, it went wrong again. Oh, what is happening? Okay, please just say we won the match. I don't even know what is happening. Well, please let me... Okay, we won. We won. Thank God. It was actually kind of close, though. He did not get disqualified. Well, we got the final key. I think it is time to take on the final boss of this game. Well, he's saying he can fly through everything with his super power suit. Look at your bare feet. I pity you. Well, I pity you because we are hacking. We're going to be using Napoleon, and we're going to absolutely destroy you. Well, we chose Napoleon, but for some reason is choosing the regular dog, but that's okay. Anyway, it looks like he's got our crown. He tripped up. The crown has fallen somewhere and we have to get it back. And we are doing an intense battle. Well, let's go. I am ready to absolutely destroy him. And oh no, oh no. Our hacks aren't going to work, are they? Well, it kind of sucks that we're not traveling at hypersonic speeds. But honestly, it probably would have broken the game if I was. So let's just try not to die. And let's steal our crown back and win this game. Last time I did a boss fight like this, I died. So let's try not to die this time. And that was really close. I did not realize that thing would kill me. Also, I think those things are checkpoints, which is really cool. So even if I do die, it's not the end of the world. But it looks like this is honestly pretty easy. It really reminds me of Mario, dude. We have to be coming close. I've been running for absolutely ages. Come on, we can do this. Let's try not to jump in this lava. I think that would be a pretty bad idea. Nope, we're not going to jump in. We're not going to die. We're going to beat this first try. And we're going to steal our crown back. I think we're almost there. We just jumped down a massive underground 
hole and it looks like there is a rock coming to kill me. There's also lava jumping out of the ground. So let's stop here for a second. Oh no, the rock's coming for me. Okay, let's just jump over you. Let's wait here. I don't think the alien is anywhere near me anymore. And I think we're going to steal our crown back. Well, guys, there is our crown. It looks like it's kind of on a throne. Let's take our crown and let's get the win in this game. Oh, just like that. Congratulations. You win. As you can see, we have beaten the alien duck. Well, we got the crown. So of course, we're going to have to put the crown on our duck and see how awesome he looks. Well, it says that all traders can train you beyond limit, but I'm, I'm pretty sure we can do that already with hacks. Well, we have the golden crown at last, so let's put that on Doc, and as you can see, he looks really cool. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed the video and the Duck Life Space series. If you did watch this far into the video, thank you guys so much. Make sure to leave a heart emoji in the comment section, and I will try and heart as many comments as I can, but yeah, I will see you guys in the next video. Have an amazing day.